Hello and welcome to mycadsite.com and this is the uh, first video for level 2 which deals with more uh, concrete drawings versus just exercises like in the first level. So here I'm just looking at the standard drawing that you've used in the previous tutorials and here you can see that if you look at the bottom left it's in decimal units and I want to change this to architectural for this particular project which means I'll be entering feet and inches which is uh, usually just applied to the US market but um, the same applies for metric if you just use decimal and now that I've got the, my unit set I want to set the limits which is actually my drawing space and I'll show you in a second how that works currently I'm just using the 10 by 12 but now I want something that'll fit that building you just saw so now I'm just going to make it uh, 45 feet by 35 feet. And now if I do a zoom extents, you'll see that it draws to the extents of what I've drawn, but a zoom all sh takes me out to my drawing limits. So now if I draw a line here up to the absolute point in the drawing screen of 45 comma 35, you'll see that it'll go towards the top right corner of the screen and there it is and so if erase that and you'll see that down the status line that's where I'm at so with all of that I've got my unit set limit set I'm just erasing the other things there that were down on the bottom and next thing I need to do is create layers so type in LA enter for layers and now I'm just going to move this into the window so everyone can see it and I use the icon for new and I'm just going to create some of the object layers that are needed for this drawing so I've got columns and I pick a color for them and it doesn't really matter which one it is <coughs> and I'm just going to continue going through the layer list and put in uh, all the different layers and I can use capital letters I can make it uh, the name as long or as short as I like. I always use one color for my dimensions I just find it easier to work with and putting in doors and another way to create new layers rather than just hitting the uh, new layer icons just to go alt n and that will create a new layer and here I am putting in one for furniture and changing the color and the colors are useful so that you can differentiate between what objects are on different layers and it's very important to look for that and in case we add a title block later or some text I will uh, put in a layer for that and then the last layer that I'm going to create will be for the walls and that's how I'm also going to be starting the drawing is by drawing the walls and for that I need to make the layer current which means it's the current layer that I'm drawing on and I do that by hitting the green checkbox icon and there I go and you'll see the green uh, check goes towards walls and now I'm set to drawing so stay tuned for part two and level two tutorial one on mycadsite.com thank you